What's up, everybody? It's your friendly neighborhood, Dooley Ray, and this is the fourth war of Alliance Wars Season 6. Uh, my alliance, we are the Skrulls, and we are taking on the X-Men, J-11. These guys, <laughs> these guys are really good. They are, they are 100% a master alliance, and they're going to give us a good run for our money. So let's go ahead, and I'm, I'm back on Path 6, the full Path 6, and I'm bringing in a team of Hyperion, Sparky, and Captain America Infinity War this time. Ooh, mix it. Mixing it up. <clears throat> I'm actually not bringing in Void this time because on uh, Node 24, there is a thing that we thought was going to be not good. That was a great way of putting that. <laughs> uh, it was going to be, we were thinking it was going to be Kingpin or Agent Venom or something, so we assumed it would be probably better to just not, not uh, bring in Void for that fight. So anyways, going in, going to boost myself up. I have quite a few boosts at this point. My alliance has pitched in because I keep on complaining about boosts. <laughs> so, uh, I, I wish I didn't. I don't know. If I could manage to not boost, I'd be a happy man. I'd be very happy. But boosting is part of alliance war at this point. So got to boost up. And yeah, I got, got lots of boosts to go through. Um... I've only got one invulnerability boost left, though, and at this point, I kind of just want to save it for any future fights that I may have. So, gonna go ahead and uh, go into this fight here. We're thinking it's gonna be an Emma Frost. Kind of want to use the invulnerability for this because I'm not the best at dodging her special attacks, but um, hopefully it'll go okay. I I miss the a pair. Well, I miss attacking her after she throws her heavy attack there. So that was my mistake. This note is just so freaky because with Stark Spidey, I really want to build up poise charges. But at the same time, I need to get those Furies off or she's going to hit me like a freaking truck. So I'm um, trying to manage her power here. Going to uh, play as best as I can. I mean, there's not too much to be said beyond that. Um, I think whenever she has a power bar above me, she's out of her diamond form. So I really should have waited to throw that special too. But at the time, I was just I just wanted to get the fight done. Luckily, I get a good crit and one more special two or one. And she's down. So, Stark Spidey does the trick there, and that leaves me quite happy, very satisfied indeed. And we move on to the next node, which is the Bane Stun Immune node, and there's a Cosmic Champion here, so I, I don't think I'm going to want to take in Stark Spidey, and I brought in Captain America Infinity War specifically for the Power Shield node. There's a, uh, <clears throat> there's a Mystic Champion on the Power Shield node, and I was going to use him for it, but I decided, hmm, I'll try uh, Captain America on this node. It is Stun Immune, so I can take some block damage, and... Uh, well, beyond that, I mean, I'll just do some damage. Turns out this node is a King Root, so it's going to be an interesting fight for sure. With Bane, I just got to be careful about how I time everything, and also, I mean, I can't stun them, so I'm not going to be able to get the Fury off of my heavy attack, really. So, you know, looking back, maybe this wasn't the smartest idea, but I'm going to try and be careful about my Bane transfers. Um, I don't know if I'm going to try and get the armor break to... Uh, I can't remember. I, I doubt it. I'm not that dumb. So I'd, I'd get Bane on me if I tried to do that. All right. Anyways, I'm getting some good Bane transfers here, but I'm really just trying to get that special one out of King Groot. He was just, he was not having it. He was not throwing it. He's not playing for me. So another Bane transfer. Doing really well. I mean, my health is at 97%. So, I mean, this fight, as far as was concerned, as far as I'm concerned, it's going pretty well. So I think at this point, I just want to get the Bane off myself. I decide, okay, I can just, I can push him to a special two. I'll deal with it. Uh, I just want to get Bane off. So I go ahead, I throw my special two to get as much damage as possible. He throws his special two. I get uh, some blocked hits. No problem, because Captain America blocks like a champion. There we go. I get another Bane transfer. He's at 9% health. And one more combo might do the trick with a special, no, just one more combo. There we go. So that was actually, that was a fun fight. I enjoyed that. Uh, Captain America did the trick, and uh, I'm happy. All right, moving on to this buffet node. Uh, I couldn't bring in Void for this fight, so Stark Spidey it is. It's a uh, 565, actually. So I'm going to go ahead and look at this guy's profile and see what he's got. Oh, well, I guess I'm fighting Thor Ragnarok on this node, which I actually could have used Void for. And actually, Void would have been pretty handy dandy to have if we're being honest but um it's all good stark spidey should be able to handle this 100 percent, no problem as long as i play like a pro which i can do i can definitely do all right so gonna build up some poise charges here 
because if I don't build up Poise Charges, I'm not going to hit hard enough to take him down. He's going to heal too much back from the Buffet Note, and I won't be able to uh, won't be able to kill him. Destroy everything he loves. So I go ahead and parry him there. Uh, this is a Limber Node, so I have a limited number of parries. I want to be careful about that, but um, I just got to try and get special attacks out of him. I got to be careful with my special attacks, because he's going to get his Thunder thingy majigger whatever you want to call it. So I push him to 19, and then I do that, and then I push myself to a special 2, so that I can throw it. Boom, boom. Just like that. Nailed it. Oh, and then I drop my block, or just don't block at all. Or he just... I don't know, he slipped one in there. He was very sneaky. And then I'm in a bad place, because I almost I almost let myself get hit there with Limber, but I, I got I managed to get the power drain off, so I guess it paid off in the end, but that was, was kind of risky on my part. I could have played that better. I definitely could have played that better, but I, I was just, I was really worried about that power. If he got one more hit on me, he would have gotten a special three, and I could have died there. Ah, uh, why do I have to make things so complicated? You're acting like something else is getting me so frustrated. Dang it, what are the lyrics? I don't know. <clears throat> Anyways, 565 Domino. Yay. Oh my, Sig 200. Goodness, can we chill on the uh, Sig 200 Dominoes on this node, guys? Please? Because it's ridiculous. <laughs> Going into this fight, I don't use invulnerability because it won't do anything for me. She'll put a giant bleed on me if I push her to her special three. So I gotta be careful here. I'm gonna go ahead and back off and look at that degen damage I'm taking. Oh my gosh. All right. I think in the last fight I had, I think I had the blade synergy, which really helped out when fighting against Domino. Maybe I didn't, maybe I'm wrong, but I think I did. And those extra poise charges, really, really helpful, especially on this note here. But uh, I'm, I'm staying on a steady pace of keeping her uh, equal to or just below where I'm at on my, uh, on my health bar. And I'm just, I'm taking degen damage. It's ridiculous. I hate this. I freaking hate this fight. I swear. Um, it's not even that it's that hard. I'm, I'm totally fine with all of Domino's abilities or evading everything except for the degen. The degen is so stupid and I hate it. It's just a a drain on potions for no reason. So, a bit unfortunate. Uh, oh, and also, I start to mistime things. I get a... I try to throw a heavy attack. It doesn't work. Um, at this point, I know I need to get that power out of her, and I if I do another 5-hit combo, well, she'll have a special 3. So, I'm in a precarious situation. Between a rock and a hard place? Something like that. So, I throw a heavy attack off her heavy attack, and it doesn't power drain her, because... Stupid domino. <laughs> Screw domino. <laughs> you know? Screw domino. So, yeah, I died there. Hmm. Sad. Sad face. But that's not the end of the tale. And actually, at this point, I, uh... I stopped recording. I went and I chatted with an officer trying to discuss what my plans were. She's in Assassin's Ring. She's, I'm pretty sure she's at 18%. So I decided, hmm, you know what would be a good idea? If I brought in Captain America Infinity War on this node. And you know what happened? I died again. Twice. I got her down to like 2% with Captain America, and then she uh, she broke through my block. Or I just sucked. Can't, can't really tell you which happened, but... Gosh dang it, Domino, I hate you, and your parents as well. So, um, yeah, that sucked. Don't know what else to say about that. Um, two deaths there. Uh, the Mystic Note up here, since Captain America was dead, got taken out. I, I revived Stark Spidey for the final 2%. That was stupid of me. I should have just taken in Hyperion, but I wanted to be careful and make... Because I felt like a total idiot for uh, not using Spidey to finish off Domino. What I was My thought process there was that I didn't want to use a revive, and I was just, I was being greedy. Shouldn't have done that. Total mistake on my part. Very frustrating. But let's move on to the next day. The next day, we go ahead, we come in here. There is a 565 Cosmic Champion on this, uh, on this node here. It's going to be a Medusa, which is actually pretty cool. I don't know if I've ever fought Medusa on this node, but I'm bringing in Hyperion, so things should hopefully go my way. I, I don't know if at this point, I think the war was decided, and we were not gonna win no matter what so we were just trying to clear everything clear everything up so i'm gonna do a couple of smaller boosts just to try and get uh hyperion going here total of like 25 percent health and attack 
altogether. Uh, I just want to make sure I can get this Medusa down, and uh, this is a pretty interesting fight. So coming into it, gonna throw some heavy attacks. I think this is, if I'm remembering right, this is also when I'm at work. It was, yeah, I think I think I was at work at this point, so. Distracted, that's why I'm not amazing, always. <clears throat> okay, well I got a special three, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw that just to kind of push her back. Maybe I could have saved it. Um, I wasn't really thinking about that, but thinking about it now, I, I probably could have saved that if I got backed up into the corner. Just throwing some more heavy attacks, used to the three cosmic charges, you know. Hindsight is 2020, but uh, things are going pretty well. I'm at 90% health, and Medusa is going down very quickly. I'm gonna throw a special two with all these furies I got, and boom, 17,000 crit. Oh, tasty. All right, just gotta bait a special one out of her if I can. Decided not. Luckily, she doesn't auto block there. She totally could have auto blocked there, and then I would have you know, taken some serious damage. At this point, though, I mean, she's at a special two. I really don't want to bait it out of her, but I'm, I'm kind of trying to be careful. I don't know why I didn't just, you know, finish her there, but she goes down, um, and that wasn't a that wasn't a difficult fight for me. I actually quite enjoyed it. You know what fight I didn't enjoy? Domino. I hate her. Gosh. <laughs> All right. I don't do any of these other fights though, so that's the end of the war for me here. Another another tough war. What can I say? I keep on making stupid mistakes. I don't know what to say. That's what I'm here for, though. I'm here to teach you what not to do. <laughs> so uh, thank you all so much for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed. Till I see you next, hang in there. May the RNG be with you, and peace out.